Well, I think it's really important because as a species, uh, inherently, we're makers. Um, that's sort of what distinguishes us um, from other species, is that since we stood up and walked forward on two legs, we've always been makers. Um, but making is kind of absent in many teaching and learning environments. So it only makes sense to return to our origins as a species and to really emphasize learning that's based in making. To prepare students for an, a world of constant change, we cannot use the same toolbox we used like centuries ago or the way we were taught in schools. A teacher directed or it, worksheets or telling children what to do, that doesn't work anymore. 21st century learners have to be encouraged to collaborate, to be creative, to iterate, to try new things and to make. And that's what this program brings to the community. It's that empowerment that the kid has to not only see himself as capable of finding these solutions, but also capable of reinventing himself because they will be forced in the future to change many times careers and reinvent themselves and look for solutions for new problems they will encounter. I want them as prepared as possible for K-12. And the zero to five experience, that early education, is so valuable. 90% of the brain is formed by the time they are three and a half years of age. And so making sure that they have a quality educational environment from that zero to five is critical if they're gonna be successful in K-12. And so having a project like this with high quality professors coming in, working with our teachers, having them be able to collaborate with one another, having them be able to take this away after the year and, and replicate in their classrooms is only gonna serve this community better and prepare the K-12 schools.